Hello fam. In today's video, we are going to talk about witchcraft from the village or witchcraft in the village or witchcraft over villages. Um, I know for us in South Africa, a lot of people move to the big city, but they are originally from some kind of smaller village where the family is, where it's a more traditional upbringing. But the young generation move to the to the city or the adults move to the city for work purposes i want you to watch this clip with me it is a deliverance clip that i did it's a while ago now maybe two or so weeks and this young lady in this video she is the first one from her village she's in south africa she's the first one from her village to finish high school go to university have a career watch the clip and then we talk about it. Oh, she will cause destruction in my kingdom. We break your kingdom with the blood of Jesus. We already destroying your kingdom. Fire on your kingdom in the name of Jesus. The fire of the Holy Spirit on your kingdom in Jesus' name. Fire. I want men in this community to drink and be irresponsible, not get married. Yeah. That's why, that's why, that's why I made them, I made them to drink and be irresponsible, abandon their kids. Fire of the Holy Spirit over the siren from the marine kingdom. Fire of the oh, Holy one. Spirit over the siren from the marine kingdom. Fire of the Holy Spirit over in the name of Jesus Christ hey, over the community. Hey, hey, hey. We loosen the hey, bond hey, that you have hey, done hey, in the hey, name of hey, Jesus. Hey, hey. Oh, don't, don't, don't. Yay, yeah, 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 yay, yeah. yay. We loosen the bonds that you have done in the community. Every man you have influence in the community. We ask the Holy Spirit to give them back their senses. We ask the Holy Spirit to wake them up in the spiritual realm. We expose you in the community. I want to destroy them. They want to destroy them. Even they are killed. That's why they are kids. It's me. We put the blood every, of every, Jesus every, over every, every child every, in that community every, and in neighboring communities. Every, we put the blood of Jesus over every child, over every adult, over every old person in those communities. We pray Father, to destroy these strongholds. Release your angels into those areas, Father, to destroy the strongholds. Release flaming arrows covered with the blood of Jesus into those areas, Father, to wake the people up, to break, to break the power of the enemy. Father, release, release, release your angels into those areas, Lord, to go and destroy the power of the enemy me in Jesus name that are made. Father release your angels into that area. Release your angels. We declare spiritual warfare right now on that area in Jesus mighty name. We declare breakthrough and breakthrough and spiritual breakthrough in that area in Jesus name. We declare that the bonds and the chains of wickedness, of drunkenness, of poverty, of backwardness, of neglect, of rape, of abuse, of molestation is broken in that area. I ask you, Father, release your angels into that area, Father, to uproot and destroy this wickedness. In Jesus' mighty name, your covenants are broken in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. All witchcraft leave her right now and go to the pit. And the Holy Spirit is doing a mighty work in her hometown where she comes from. Your covenants are broken in Jesus' mighty name. I do not have to be successful. She will set the whole community free. She already has. So this is a spirit that her grandfather brought into a river in the village. Her grandfather went to fetch this demonic, this mermaid spirit and brought it into the a river in the village.
to come and rule over that area to make him wealthy. And in this video clip, this spirit is saying the following. I make the men in this area drunkards so that they cannot be good husbands, so that they cannot be good fathers. Okay, so automatically marriages in this area don't last. The men is that for the first time ever since I've been in ministry, did someone undress in a deliverance session. That is how this mermaid's spirit was on fire. This young lady undressed on camera. Just going to show the blood of Jesus Christ, the fire of the Holy Spirit, the sword of the Spirit, which is the living word of God, our Bibles, are nothing to be messed with in the spiritual realm. They are swords, they are weapons, and we use them against Satan's kingdom. Many times we see these videos on TikTok. This is witchcraft. The same Bito are the voodoo spirits of the night. They take possession of nine living objects and start dancing to the sound of the African drum. Are uh, being paraded in the center of the village where these ceremonies are being had in the village to celebrate the spirits of the village. Well, that's exactly what it is. It is a demonic spirit, a principality that is in power or has been given authority or legal right to that village. So those people will never come out of abject poverty because why? This demon keeps them poor and suffering. And the more poor and the more suffering the, uh, they are, the more they turn to the spirit. The more they turn to witch doctors. The more they turn to sangomas in the village to help them. So it is a continuous cycle of poverty and witchcraft. Your dreams will tell you if you are under any demonic covenants from the village. Okay, from your own village back home or your grandparents' villages, you will dream A, constantly being taken back to the village. B, there is a river or a body of water in the village where you are always swimming. C, you are constantly being taken into a group of witches, into a cauldron, into some sort of, of, of ritual happening in the village. D, you are constantly lost in the village. Any dreams that take you back to your village, to your childhood home, to your ancestral lineages are demonic dreams. There are strongholds from that village. There are demonic powers that have been given authority from your village to rule over the people. So when you try to educate yourself and you try to break away, Though in your sleep, your spirit keeps getting pulled back into your family if there is witchcraft from your village. And many, many people, because you grow you're in your life, your career, you leave the village, you go to the big city to try and make something of yourself. Witchcraft will be spoken from back home to say, we bind your blessings, we bind your success, we bind your growth, we bind your prosperity. Because they believe the, the witches and the warlocks and the evil people from those villages, sometimes neighbors, sometimes your own family members, they will say, who the hell do you think you are to be successful? And yet our children, our family members in the village are not successful. They're still in poverty. They're still struggling. It's because they choose to worship Satan. So if you are having any of these dreams, any of these attacks, you are seeing these things and you can see that in your life this is a reality. There's a strong man from back home, from the village, from the neighborhood, from the area. Come against the root of the curse. Break it in Jesus' name. Prayer, fasting, curse breaking, renunciation, Disconnect yourself from any altars that you were dedicated to back in the village. God bless you fam.